We're now two weeks away from the start of the new league year. Free agency officially opens on March 18th at 4 p.m., and there's a lot that could happen between now and then. A big question going into free agency is just how active will GM Eric DaCosta be when that new league year opens? Now, it does feel a bit different this season compared to past years, and that's because the Ravens have a little bit more money to play with. As things stand right now, the Ravens have about $30 million in cap space, and that number could go up or down a little bit depending on what they do with Matthew Judon and the franchise tag and whether they release any players to free up some more space. That's a decent chunk of change, and with that kind of cap room, I'd expect the Ravens to be in the mix on some of the big free agents this year. They want to address as many needs as possible before the draft, so that means they can try to get a quality pass rusher or maybe another receiver in free agency. Now, it's impossible to predict exactly who they would try to get, but it would not surprise me at all if you hear the Ravens connected to some of the marquee players when the market opens. Just look at last season as an example. The Costa was active, but he was also patient. The Ravens were quiet the first couple of days, but then boom, they signed Earl Thomas, they signed Mark Ingram, and the Ravens would love to get some more Pro Bowl players like that on the roster. And with more cap room this year, the Costa could get pretty creative in free agency. So it's going to be a fun stretch, and to make sure you're on top of all the latest transaction and free agency news, download the latest version of our mobile app, and make sure you turn on those push notifications. As soon as we get the news, we'll send it directly to your phone. That's it for me on Final Drive. Thanks for watching. We'll see all of you again tomorrow.